Hello and welcome to another edition of uh, Fours and Sixes with me, Swarup Swaminathan. In today's edition, we'll be talking about the match between Sunrisers Hyderabad and uh, Punjab Kings, two teams who occupy uh, the bottom two places uh, in the league standings. As far as uh, Hyderabad is, is concerned, uh, they are probably out of the tournament even if they win. Uh, all six of the remaining games they are probably not going to make it to the knockout stages because that's the way the table is is uh, shaped at the moment uh, saying that there are a few fascinating questions uh, pertaining to the franchise with david warner's form is one of them will they probably be looking at not retaining any of them except rashid khan abdul samad has shown glimpses of his uh, natural talent so if he can showcase what he is capable of doing uh, the franchise can probably consider him in a big way going forward uh, uh, moving on to punjab kings uh, what the, what the franchise really needs to do uh, starting tomorrow is pick up points from matches where they absolutely dominate uh, save the last uh, 10 or 15 minutes it happened to them in the last game against rajasthan royals i think they needed about 3 uh, or 4 to win in the final over but fluff their lines it is something that they should stop doing and if if they actually can pick up two points from tomorrow's game they can put pressure on the likes of uh, mumbai indians who do not play until sunday speaking about uh, key men for them we saw what ashdeep singh can do with his uh, left arm angle he is uh, he is a big big personality then there's the likes of uh, kl rahul mayank agarwal uh, chris gail who sat out from the first game nicholas puran they are very very top heavy side and, he, and if they can uh, perform to the potential i think uh, punjab kings will probably win uh, tomorrow's match uh, th- thanks for watching another edition of uh, fours and sixes uh, that's all bye bye